Hi there and thanks for watching. Now my next project in the small shop organization is actually doing something with this. The back area here has never been used for anything and what I want to do is install a French cleat system using the existing wooden supports which originally held up the shelves which were here and then using some scrap wood which actually came from the shelves themselves. They were actually just simple pine. I had them ripped down and I cut the cleats on an angle so I could use both sides of the actual piece. So that's what I'm going to do next. I'm going to put up some of this thin board here as a backer and then attach the wood as the cleats. Now I'm going to do something interesting with the cleats but uh, you'll see that coming along later in the video. So follow along and I'll see you at the end. So just a quick update, I've finished the French cleat system and installed it. I put the first organizer in place. It's a holder for uh, two of my drills. The other one I have is a different format, but you can see that they just slide in battery. The reason I did it like that is because otherwise what happens is it would sit right on the uh, switch here for the direction so I didn't want that getting impacted by sitting so that's quick I have a little uh, uh, organizer here for bits and that sort of thing stuff that you know you use with a drill I was thinking about putting chargers on this unit but I realized that those are not things that I reach for all the time if the battery needs to be charged I can have the charger set up uh, somewhere else and it just takes an hour to charge so I could even uh, put that on a shelf uh, 
The one uh, interesting little uh, twist here is that literally it is a twist. So what I have is I've put a, uh, a lock and unlock here. I'll show you how that works in a second. But when it's locked, you'll see you can't lift the unit off uh, the cleat. And I was just thinking sometimes if you've got something heavy and you hit it, it can spill the entire unit off of the cleat. And so when you turn it 180 degrees to unlock here, you'll see that you can just lift it off. And if you look at the back, the way it works is that I've just taken a dowel and run it uh, through with a screw and a little dab of glue to hold it on. And when it's unlocked, you'll see I've cut the dowel so that you can actually um, lift it off. And when it's unlocked, that's the, the setting. When it's locked, it turns and it locks it down. So when you want to put it back, it's very easy, straightforward, just right on there. And then you lock it down again. Can't come off. So that's it for the French cleat system. Thanks for watching and um, look forward to the next video when I concentrate on creating extra space with some more desk surface here and also to clean up the mess in the corner. Thanks for watching.